Welcome to another episode on our channel. I'm not in my typical blue shirt. The lions didn't make it, but there's always next year. Mm, so close. Anyway, we're um, we're doing this figure again. You've seen Geralt of Rivia before, aka The Witcher, performed by Henry Cavill. Uh, that came out in 2019. He is leaving the series. He will be replaced by Liam Hemsworth. But I really like his character. I also love Yennefer, who's in the series. And I think I've figured out how I'm going to do her, to replicate her. This was made by Buzz Toys. And I think they did a fantastic job on this character. What's new... In this situation is not the the beast's foot, not, not that at all. It is actually a substantial weight, but I decided since Geralt is known as the white wolf, I decided to put a white wolf next to him. This is either JXK Studios, Mr. Z or something else. I think it's one of those two though, in the sense that it weighs a ton and seems to be very well made. So it is a white wolf. So it's fitting. So we'll pause now and get him on a turn tray so we can see him from different angles along with the white wolf and then get some tighter close-ups of Geralt. We are back and here is Geralt again, made by Buzz Toys. I think they did a fantastic job, not only with the outfit, but what appears to be a studded shirt and bracers, very nicely done. He came with two swords. I happen to like this one the best. He also had kind of like a, a leather enclosement thing that he could put on his shoulder where you could put one of the swords in or both the swords in. I, I like to keep things simple. And of course this, this part of the foot of a beast, but I had to put a white wolf in here. It just didn't seem right without a white wolf. So I'm trying to figure out how to do Yennefer and I think I have an idea. I hope it works out. We'll see what happens. But he's cool. He has his hooded cape. And again, I think they did a great job, not only on the outfit, the sword, two swords actually, but the head sculpt is, from my perspective, amazing. To have this thing in here is a nice, cool touch. The claws are actually kind of sharp too, you know, when you, when you feel them. But again, I couldn't resist putting a wolf in it. So we'll get some tighter close-ups from here on up and then of his face. Here he is again. I think Buzz Toys did a tremendous job on this figure. I really like the sword and the, the design to the sword. It's, it's cold to the touch, some sort of metal alloy has been used. Love his necklace. I love the studs on his jacket, on the bracers as well. We'll just do some profile shots here. It's molded hair, but it looks great. I love the hood, hooded cape. And we'll see the other side come around. There he is. What's so cool about this figure is he has animal-like eyes. So we'll see that in the close-up. So we'll pause now and get a close-up of the head sculpt. This is a wonderful close-up of his face. The eyes are absolutely intense. And again, it gives it an animal-like look. I really like 
what Les Toys did in terms of this entire figure as well as the head sculpt. Here's one last look at our figure of the day, Geralt, with his white wolf. I hope you've liked what you've seen. If you have, consider giving us a thumbs up and subscribing to our channel. In the meantime, everyone, please have a great day.